So this is the moment Sharon's husband saw her for the first time wearing her wedding dress all dressed up on their wedding day. He got emotional and started crying. This beautiful wedding dress is made by Vicky James. Vicky James is one of the popular Nigerian fashion designers. She's very good with her craft. Her craft are very beautiful, unique, simple and modest. So she's the one that made this wedding dress. He has speak. So I was just in church at Alex House for a service and Sharon Oja was in church. At the end of the service, she comes to me and says, Vicky, actually she's been text texting me on Instagram. She's been telling me that she wants to see me about something very private. She wants to talk to me about something. I'm like, what could this be? And she's been giving me missed calls. So that day she was like, Vicky, I'm trying to reach you. It's important. You are making my wedding dress. And I'm like, what? You're getting married? And it was before my wedding. Now I know why Sharon's wedding turned out beautifully. She took her time to plan her wedding because Vicky's James' wedding was in February. So you can see from February to now, that means it took them about six months to plan for the wedding and everything. No wonder, now I understand. So I was so happy, you know, I felt like I found a twin. <laughs> I'm like, you're getting married and she says yes. And she says, I know that you're making my wedding dress. She says to me, I've spoken with my family and friends and everyone chose you. And I was so excited. I looked forward to the making of the dress. And here we are, the wedding day is here and it's today and I'm standing right in front of the masterpiece that we have created for Sharon Oja. Only God knows how long it took them to beat this wedding dress. Can you see? So beautiful. For the first, I think the first few weeks of being engaged, I didn't know what I wanted to look like. And then I went to church and I saw you and I was like, Vicky, you're making my dress. Do you remember that combo last year? And then that was how I had, the, the only thing I knew I had in mind was I wanted lines and I wanted illusion. I just wanted a lot of lines that were connecting each other. That's all I wanted. This took a lot of work, a lot, a lot of time, a lot of sleepless nights, a lot, tons, thousands of beads and crystals and sequins of just sparkly beads because Sharon wanted a white dress that would shine, that would shine to the ends of the earth basically. And we delivered just that, as you can see. And no one like you. I knew how to be Vicky James from the jump, and that's the gospel truth. After I got engaged last year, I felt like I, I had a vision of how I wanted to look. I wanted body silhouettes. And who better to go to than the body silhouette queen herself? <laughs> the queen of snatching. I just knew that I wanted to look clean and elegant. And I knew it was you. And I said, you remember we had like a prayer session in church? And then I saw you, and then I told you, this was last year. I think, you know, I didn't announce your marriage. I don't know if you had announced. But yeah, and I said to you that I wanted you to make my dress. I already knew from last year that it was going to be you. The dress is really sparkly. That's my girl. That's my girl. That's my girl. That's my girl. That's my she, she created this masterpiece. The finest wedding gown in the history of wedding gowns. <laughs> so excited. I think I've dreamed of this day my entire life. Honestly, I'm a girly girl. And every girly girl, right from when you're small, you've already watched cartoons, movies that have made you dream of being a princess, getting married to a prince. Yeah. And no matter how much you dream of it, you don't know how to envision it more than the day itself. And I'm so grateful to God for this moment. So grateful to God for the man. You know, right? you know, like, what a man, like, honestly. Um, so I'm grateful to God that I'm walking down the aisle with this particular man in, in person. Like, I, I already know what my life as a, as a wife is already, because I've been married for a few months, but I can already imagine what my life would be as a mother, because he's, I yes, like, I like, I, I know you can relate, right? So yeah, like, today is just special, and I just really want to thank God. Yes. Exquisite. Elegant, extremely tasteful. <laughs> so this is another elegant dress made by Vicky James. You all can see how beautiful it's looking. She's the one wearing it. For those that don't know her, this is Vicky James. And this is what she wore to Sharon's wedding. Um, the lady is so talented and she's good with her craft. Girl take your flowers you know what you're doing okay so i heard about her and discovered her during her wedding when her wedding was trending so from there i started following her on instagram and since then i've been seeing all her crafts you know and all i can say is she knows what she's doing and one good thing about her crafts is they are always unique very classy and at the same time modest 
no exposing of cleavages just so classy so this is the dress she wore for the video's wedding i love this her dress so unique and beautiful in fact everything she makes always turns out beautiful and she got the body the way her dress is usually fit perfectly on her body is another thing that needs to be studied in fact she's just so good let's give it to her the only wahala be say since she got married we have followers never rest that's so she they paper us with her man every ak market day anyways they look so cute together i won't even deny that fact i like how they always you know dress up and the bond between both of them is so sweet to watch it's so sweet to behold now single people and people will not get man now them are the pity because i don't say a lot of them by now go down for under depression make could have no verse is her tongue you push allow her to do her thing hmm? when you get your own man you can do your own eh he uh -huh. you go reach everybody last last this is another dress she wore to sharon's wedding as well i think this is for white wedding why the other one is for traditional wedding so let me know your favorite in the comment section what do you think about all her crafts do you know her let me know at the comment section bye guys